Welcome back to Moonshine Performance. Today we have some 2006 Ford Ranger wheels. So uh, I was cleaning the truck up the other day and I realized that these wheels are rusted. I didn't even notice because the rest of the truck was dirty, but I was cleaning everything else and uh, I looked down and saw that there was a whole bunch of rust, which I knew it was there, I just didn't realize how bad it really was. And so I wanted to do something about it. So I went out and picked up some uh, Rust-Oleum bed liner here. And now this stuff is gonna be like a textured coat so I'm going to go around and do is tape off the outside of the bead here and make sure that I don't get any on the sidewall of the tire because that is not good for the tire. And I want these tires to last a while. And uh, I'm going to tape that off and put plastic bags around it. And then I'm going to go through and put a few coats on of this stuff and then uh, see how it turns out. What I'm going to go ahead and start now is getting uh, this first layer of dirt off here. So all this surface rust right here is not going to come off. I'm going to use some 400 grit sandpaper and I'm going to do a little bit of wet sanding. And I'm just going to knock the first layer of dirt off here. You probably can't even see it, and you won't be able to notice what I did and where I went through with the sandpaper. But uh, on the long run, it'll make the paint or the bed liner adhere a little bit better and last a little longer. And then uh, after that, I'm going to go outside and hose them all off just to get them cleaner. And then come back in and wipe them down and uh, blow them off with the air compressor. And then um, I'm going to start taping up around the sidewall here. That way, I don't have any overspray. So this masking tape. Uh, a few days ago, when I washed the truck, I um, used some tire shine just to shine up the tires a little bit. And this tape will not adhere to this rubber very well if there's tire shine on it because it's kind of an oily uh, fluid type thing. So I'm going to go through with some acetone and wipe off the sidewall. I know that you're not really supposed to use chemicals on your tires because they won't last as long and it'll kind of ruin them. But I'm just going to go through real quick and get the tire shine off. That way I can put this tape on here. So I don't get any overspray from the bed liner onto the sidewall of the tire. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and start cleaning these up now. So I just finished this wheel, and uh, I think I think it turned out pretty well. It's got this uh, real rough texture, and that's kind of what I was going for, because uh, I saw it on another set of wheels, and I really liked it. And uh, it covered real well, and I hardly had to put any prep work into it, and uh, I think it turned out really nice. So I'm going to get these, uh, get all the rest of the three done, and then mount it up on the truck, and uh, I'll show you when I'm done. So I just finished getting the wheels back on the truck and getting it all done. Uh, I only used one can of that Rust-Oleum stuff and I actually got it from Harbor Freight. Uh, it cost me about $20 in all because I had a 20% off coupon 
and with tax and everything I also had to get a roll of masking tape and uh, this whole project only took me about six hours maybe maybe five or six hours but I really think it ties the truck together and uh, makes it look really good I'll insert a picture now of what it used to look like uh, before I did anything to it with the rusty wheels and uh, I think you can tell it really made a difference eventually with the other can I think I'm gonna go back and do the front bumper and the grill there and uh, as well as the rear bumper and all the door handles and stuff like that just to bring it out because you can see that it's kind of gray it's not as vividly black as the uh, wheels are or even the bed liner that's already in there so I think I'm gonna go back and finish the rest of it finish the rest of the can off uh, I did have to get into that can a little bit for these wheels but not much only one coat on one wheel I think it was actually this front wheel up here and uh, so I still have a lot left and for 20 bucks I think that's a pretty good price I'm gonna see how long it lasts I heard that it lasts about three years and uh, so we'll see. And uh, that's it. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned.